I'm going to demonstrate Active Brand Mold Stain Remover. This mold stain has built up on my washer, so we're going to try to remove it. Thank you to Active for sending me this product to try. First of all, this is what's in the box, and uh, I'll take the top off, and it's a gel. I'm going to squeeze the gel over all of the stain. So I'm squeezing it out, trying to cover it all. There is quite a lot. Seems like this builds up pretty fast. I cleaned it with something else a few months ago. Okay, there's some little dirty spots over here. It's hard to see if you're covering it all or not, but I'm sure you can always go back and do it again. Also down here in this opening, it needs to be covered. So I'll just squirt some in here. I can't really tell if I'm getting it covered, but at least we'll do some good and I can do it again later. Okay, that's pretty much covered. Here I see a spot. Next, we wait three to five hours and we give the gel time to harden. Then we come back and do the next step. So I'll see you in five hours. I'm back. It's been longer than five hours because when I came back after five hours, the gel had not turned hard. I guess I put some places on too thick, but I can do better next time. This was my first trial. So now I am wiping it away and there is quite a difference. I probably didn't cover everything very good. But you can see it did a pretty good job. And back here, I can't really get into that very well. But I'll have to rinse my cloth out and try again. Actually, this is a very hard thing to get rid of. I've tried everything on my washer seal before trying to get it clean. And nothing hardly phases this stuff. It just stays and builds up again. So, it didn't get much of that, but it's a little better. So, I will just try again another time, but I think the product is worth it because it really did get rid of most of it, and that is such a hard thing to get rid of. So, I would recommend this product.